Hey, what's up everyone? How's everyone doing today? This is Mark Perry and today I want to shoot this real quick video to give you three ways of how you can invest your money into real estate. Now, number one way that you can invest your money into real estate and be an investor is by being a hard money lender. And a hard money lender basically lends their money out to investors for rehabs, fix and flips, uh, to actually for them to get a return or them to uh, fix and flip the property and typically how it works is hard money like to charge anywhere from one to three percent points up front and then they like to get a little bit of down payment of the purchase price and then they also like to charge you a fixed rate which will be you know around a 10 to a 12 percent interest only and how you can make cash flow through this because let's say if a person gets a fix and flip and let's say you know their holding cost is going to be for six months so in six months you can make cash flow in six months and then when they resell it, you're going to get your principal back and then you also can make a little percentage on the back end once they sell as well. So it's kind of like you get money up front, which will be the down payment. You'll get cash flow as they hold on to the property for six months and then when they sell it, you'll get a little bit of a percentage on the back end as well. So that's the number one way that you could be an investor into real estate. Number two is you can actually do rental properties. Well, what does that mean? A rental property you can actually go out there and go find properties that need to be fixed up or you can buy turnkey properties it doesn't matter where you can get a ROI on your money you know if you want to if you're looking to get a double digit return that can be anywhere from 10 to 15 percent depends on the property and depends on what the rents are or you can buy a property to where you can go buy it you can buy it cheap and then you can put money into it you put a tenant in there you have a property manager managing a tenant and what you do is you refinance you do a cash out refi you pull money out at 75 or 70 percent loan to value you pull that money out and then you go buy more properties and you repeat and you repeat and you repeat the cycle so that's the other way that you actually can invest your money into rental properties the third thing what you can do is be a passive investor through commercial real estate, which will be apartment buildings or mobile home parks. How does this work? So basically you'll just be a silent partner. So basically you've got a hundred thousand, hundred fifty thousand dollars and you want to invest with somebody that's a good operator that has a great track record that can perform these, these are multifamily apartment buildings. And you can be a passive investor by getting a return on your money, you know, anywhere from a nine to a 12% cash on cash. And you'll also get a little bit of the upside once the property sells in, you know, five or 10 years. So basically how it works is, let's say if you invest your money and you're going to get a 10% preferred rate, and then we're going to refinance it. And then we're going to, we're going to pull all your money back to you. And then we're also going to give you an extra 10% on top of that. And then you're also going to have 10% into the building once it sells. So that's another way that you actually can invest as a passive investor into apartment buildings. So keep in mind the three things that I shared with you, there shouldn't be no benefit of a doubt that you shouldn't be able to go somewhere and go park your money and go get a return on your money. If your money's in the stock market, if it's not making a return, you can always park your money in the real estate. If you got individuals that you know that has a good track record, you have relationships with them, because remember, this is a relationship business. You wanna have a relationship with those individuals, somebody that has a great track record, and someone, somebody that, can, uh, that you can hold accountable that can do these deals uh, with or without you being there. So that was today's topic. So I just shared with you, my friends, three ways how you can invest your money into real estate and get a return on your money. So I hope that that video helps. And if you haven't already, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm gonna be sharing more and great content with you in further videos. Well, that's all I got for today. And I'll see you guys on the other side. Thanks.